So when I come across something that's pretty cool, I gotta stop in and talk to these guys. And we found something here, and it came in very handy. And yeah, you know, we'll let uh, we'll let John here tell us more about this stuff. Um, probably the most popular product we had at the show this this year is our battery heated glove. So it uses a polymer battery with four different heat settings, um, high, and then down correspondingly and off. So what we do with our glove is we we put a, the battery right here. And then we embed a stainless steel mesh throughout the top, through the fingertips, and down the thumb. So when you're riding, you're always in this type of a position. So we provide heat to that most important part. Right. Okay, I gotta stop you because when sure. I, I tried this thing on, and the cool thing about it, you, know, you say stainless stainless steel mesh. That's right. I can't feel any no wires. wires in there, and it does definitely heat up the front of your hand, which is pointing towards the wind and the slush and the snow. Yeah. Exactly, so we make sure when you feel through here there's no wires, so you don't ever get any hot spots or discomfort zones from the wires. Then we put it inside of a, a Gore-Tex type material, so it's waterproof, so you can take this glove and you can poke it in the water and your hand stays dry. But it's a one-way membrane, so it actually breathes, so your hand doesn't get all hot and sweaty inside. So it's really cool technology. We use our, we use our battery technology to heat other products that we make, like our vests, and jackets. So with the vest and jackets, we give you heat on demand. So you simply push the button and you can select low, medium, or high. And it heats you in the most important part. So it heats you in the lungs, heart, and your lower back. So when your core is warm, then you pump warm blood through your body and your whole body stays warm. Well, let's let's face it. You know, we're looking for comfort when we're out riding our sleds, right? You yeah, know? absolutely. So, you know, if you're a trail driver and you want to be nice and warm for that whole ride, yeah, that's the kind of thing you really want. You bet. And that's that's why, again, a really popular product for us, because it saves on the bulk. When you're riding, you want to be maneuverable. If you have this on, you don't have to have a thick layer of clothing to be warm. Okay. Now, how long does the battery last? Um, the battery will last on this on a, on the uh, maintenance or low setting. For this, it'll last for 10 to 12 hours. On the gloves, it'll last for eight. So you can go for a pretty good day and uh, be really comfortable in your riding. Yeah. You were saying that Canada produces more mascots than just about any other country? That yeah, true? that's right. So um, believe it or not, in Canada, four of the largest mascot companies in the world are actually in Canada. There's two in Ontario and uh, two in Alberta. And you look after those guys. You're we the cooling specialist as We're well. We're the cooling specialist for all the mascots. So most of those guys, you wonder, how do they run around in that hairy suit all day and not die? Well, we help them do that. And we use a paraffin-based cooling pack. So this paraffin-based cooling pack freezes at 14 degrees Celsius. So you put that in the fridge and it freezes? In the fridge or a cooler full of ice water and it'll freeze solid. Then you wear it. The reason 14 degrees is important is when if it froze at zero, as you know, you put ice on your skin, it burns. Well, at 14, it's just nice and cool. So it keeps you cool and your temperature gets regulated by doing that. So we give you a vest with that, with those packs in it and it keeps you cool for two to three hours. Well, and that would have other applications other than just mascots. You bet. Um, mascots, uh, industrial, we sell a lot to industrial supply. We sell it to fire departments. We sold a lot actually to uh, the military for in Afghanistan and overseas, where it's extremely hot and they carry a large gear pack, so they wear that underneath their vests. Now, what if I'm, a, what if I'm an ATVer or a, a bike yeah, rider? Yeah, so this vest here is actually a sport type vest, like this, and we have a lot of the motocross riders use this, and ATV guys, and they wear it because we use this, this type of technology on the outside, which is evaporative cooling, and that evaporative cooling keeps the freezer packs cool. So you, you can actually go for three or four hours now and you're cool all the time. So in a performance setting, what happens is if your body and core is cool, you can perform better. Yeah, it goes without saying, right? So yeah, so very popular in the ATV and the motocross world. Okay, I, I have to attest to this because we came here, people are starting to see the mods. The mods is a cool cat. But he wasn't staying too cool because he's wearing a snowmobile suit and it's the fall and he's inside a building. So it was awesome. We just walked through here and we saw the heating and cooling specialist. And sure enough, that right there is what keeps the mods cool. And he loved it. So we can vouch for it. It yes, does work. You. And he is very impressed with it. He said he kept cool the whole time. Yeah. He, he actually came by afterwards and he goes, touch me. I'm cool. 
<laughs> well, he's kind of like that anyway. Yeah, he's kind of a cool cat. <laughs> exactly. Uh, John, thank you very much. Thanks very much, guys. Very nice very, seeing you. Yeah, very cool product. And uh, check us out online at Power Mods. Okay. And uh, we'll have a whole bunch of videos up there. Sounds great. All right. Thanks, guys. We'll see you. Have a great day. So as you can see, that's some pretty cool stuff. There are a lot of cool things here at the show. If you want to check them out online, techniche-canada.com. Very interesting stuff. So let's go see what else is here.